What's going on guys, Jay Tibbs with TryThisPlay.com, bringing y'all a fire defensive setup. Now, you guys may be asking yourself, and for those who qualified, shout out to y'all, I personally did not qualify for the Mutt Drafts tournament, however, you know, a couple of my crewmates did, I'm going to be helping prepare them, lab them up, so they have the best shot at getting to the live event and winning the whole thing. Now, you guys may be asking yourself, what is the defense everyone's running? Now, you see everyone running this big nickel over G, cover three or cover two, you know, just cross manning with safeties and a linebacker. Now, what if I told you there was a better way to send pressure out of the nickel normal with nickel blitz? And it comes in versus a max protect as well. Now, I am in the Detroit Lions defense playbook. I'd recommend, especially in draft champs, if you have two safeties you can draft that are extra, you know, may cost you, uh, you know, a skill position, I'd do it because this defense is definitely worth it. Now, I have uh, on the, the, the uh, Chiefs, I have Lucas and Murray. Murray's going to be my user. I've always liked Murray over Lucas. I don't know. Lucas just, you know, doesn't use the right for me. And we have Mr. Smith right here, Traymon Smith, 93 speed. Now, I like running this flipped. It's a very, very glitchy way of running it. And yes, I am the Detroit Lions defense playbook. If you could get something with nickel normal, you should be fine. Now we're going to run this first versus just a blocked running back. Now all you're going to do is you're going to take this corner right here. You're going to flip the play and you're going to keep him there. Now you're going to press, pinch your linebackers, pinch your D-line, crash down, blitz them all. And what you're going to do with this guy right here is you're going to bluff blitz. Now I have a video on my channel, youtube.com slash jtipstv, going over some coverage adjustments on why this bluff blitz right here with a three rack is probably one of the best zones in the game. Now, what you're going to do is you're going to put them on a three rec bluff blitz, which is A, or if you're on PlayStation X, and right on the right stick, bluff blitz. He will automatically go into that three rec. Now, what you guys are going to do is you're going to hover in this gap, and as soon as you see the tight end go out on the route, this is different if they max protect, but if you see that tight end go out on the route, you're going to send that guy immediately, right away. No hesitation, just go ahead and send him. So again, flip the play, keep him there. Put him right about here, press, and you guys see how his blitz angle is different. This blitz angle will come in hot. Again, if I were to leave this blitz angle like this, it is going to scream. You know, it'll it'll work the same way. It kind of, you know, loops around weird. Uh, I actually think it comes around a little faster than the normal blitz. But I like this bluff blitz because it really, really hums through the gap. And you guys know how spies and sending spies and all that jazz is glitchy this year. So again, send him immediately. You guys see no chance to get the ball off. They're going to have to make a read just like that. So now, what do you do if your opponent max protects? You see we are max protecting right here. You know, they put on a little route concept, just two streaks and a curl. I doubt anyone with a brain will do that in the game, but in order to practice mode, we're going to do it. So same setup. Boom. Put him right about there. Pinch your D-line, crash down. Again, you're going to hover in this gap. It's important, guys. If you know they're passing, hover in this gap. If you think they're going to run, hover over here so you can shoot the gap. Now, what I like to do, especially when they're passing, put my guy in deep blue. Now, you see they are max protecting. The moment you see they're max protecting, one Mississippi, and then you send them just like that. Now, he got picked up by that running back, but you see how the offensive tackle doesn't really engage with him. Now, you can also do this another way. Again, flip the play. Right there, boom. That bluff blitz angle is messed up. Now, you don't have to pinch your line all the time. I like sometimes keeping them as is, but you always want to crash down because you want to get that looping linebacker to kind of, you know, bait a little bit. So right there, boom. Our opponent's going to max protect. We see the tight end, one Mississippi. I'm going to send him right there, boom. And that's what you want. I'm telling you guys, this blitz will come in versus max protect. You just have to read your opponent. So you guys saw, when they weren't blocking that tight end, I sent him immediately. I clicked on the right stick right away. It's kind of a split second decision. But once I see that tight end pinched like that, I'm going to wait one Mississippi. So you see, one Mississippi, click it in, boom. And you see, he comes in untouched. And that's against Marshall Yonda. Like, come on, man. You can't make this stuff up, man. Us here at TryThisPlay.com, we're not like those other orgs, those big, fancy, you know, pro players. You know, obviously, a lot of us play competitive Madden, and we want to win, but we're not going to hold back a lot of stuff from you, especially when it's this good. Now, I wouldn't be surprised if I saw a lot of people running a style of defense similar this way, and that's how a lot of people in the Madden Club Championship made it far. That nickel 335, that was a variation of this. You would just put someone in a spire, bluff blitz, and send them, and also you'd put people in the outside on hook curls, and they'd follow crossers. So, you can choose whether you want to be really aggressive on defense, which will win you games, 
like this. I mean, come on. This is first aim max protect. This is first eight people. Eight people are blocking. Two, four, six, eight. There he is. Boom. All right, I believe that's seven. A anyways, I failed math, guys. Doesn't matter. Yeah, that's six. That's six. And yep, that's seven blocking. And you guys see, four, six. So six on seven. Come on, man. Running back's doing nothing. I'll show it to you guys one more time to just show you it works. Again, the flip is important. I think the flip... This will be somewhat of a new meta if this, you know, kind of goes, gets out. Again, you can pinch your line. You don't have to. It's personal choice, really. And that's it. So, again, you see they are blocking a tight end. One Mississippi. Send him. Boom. And you see he's going to come in. I don't know what it is. I don't know what it is about the bluff blitz. But nobody's going to pick him up. Again, I'm going to try IDing him this time. That may work, you know. The ID may work. It may even stop it overall, but we're going to see. So we're going to ID him. Boom. We're going to see how that works. So again, boom. One Mississippi. And nope, didn't work. Our guy loops around, ends up reaching around, grabbing the quarterback. And again, guys, I say this all the time because my personal style play, if you guys are interested too, my tournament style ebook has the best defense in all of Madden. It's a 4-3 odd. Go copy, guys. Comes in consistently with a max protect. But... I always say this when I play defense. If your opponent is max protecting every single play, especially in a tournament like DC, they are too worried about your blitz. You've gotten in their head. There'll be plays where you can send defenses like this and really mess with them where you have people covering everywhere and they are going to be completely lost. Not sure of what to do. So guys, thank you for tuning into today's video. Make sure to smack a sub, guys. We are close to 1,500 subs here at TryThisPlay.com. means a lot. We're growing fast on YouTube. Go check our website out, guys. We have a great selection of eBooks. My personal selection I love and I put out. It's my tournament-style uh, uh, offense and defensive eBook, which contains the best blitz in all of Madden and really good offense. And then my new balanced offensive eBooks, my most explosive offense. Go check out the other crew members. Try this play. You know, got him, Coach Damon. We got all those eBooks great selection for you guys but guys make sure to leave a like comment and subscribe this is j tibbs tv signing off of trythisplay.com and as always peace